I am Aarti. Today's recipe is puffed rice upma. If I am bored of eating cereal or oatmeal in the morning, this is one of the things that come to my mind and I love it. It's very simple, quick to make and you can also serve it as an evening snack. The main ingredient in this is the puffed rice and often called as marumra in various parts of India. So let's get started. For this recipe we need 4 cups of puffed rice or marumra, half a cup onion chopped, half a teaspoon mustard seeds, half a teaspoon cumin seeds, 5 to 6 whole cashew nuts, 1 tablespoon of chana dal, 1 teaspoon of turmeric powder, 1 green chilli finely chopped, half a lime, 2 tablespoons of podam. You can refer to our podam recipe on Jatpat Kitchen blog. We have a pot heating up and I'm going to add 1 tablespoon of oil in this. Now the oil is hot, we are adding the mustard and cumin seeds. Let them splatter and to this we are adding the chana dal, the, red, the cashew nuts, green chilies, Sort them for about 15 seconds and now onions. When the onions are cooking, we'll just move back and soak the marumra for about a minute. Let's add water in the marumra bowl. Make sure that the marumra is soaking for about a minute or so. Just dip the whole marumra in water. We took about 4 cups of water. You can just push, put your hand inside and just try to squeeze in the marumra in. Let it soak for about a minute. Let's add a pinch of hal turmeric or haldi to give some additional color to the fish. The marumra has been soaking for about a minute so I'll just squeeze it with my hand. Take, take marumra into my hand and squeeze the water out and add it to the pan. Try to squeeze as much of water as you can. We added the all the squeezed out marumra from the water so let it give a mix now. To this add podam and salt for taste. And mix it. At this point of time, you can just turn off the flame and squeeze in some lemon juice and mix. And the puffed rice upma is all ready to serve. The puffed rice uh, upma is ready and we garnished it with some coriander leaves. Thanks for watching Jatpat Kitchen. We'll see you again with the next recipe.